Another one is um, fish hydrolysate. But you have to be really careful about the companies making that fish hydrolysate because if they heat it in any way, the oils start to separate and all of the bacterial foods separate from the fungal foods. And of course, then they're gonna skim off the oil because that's where all the, the dollars are in that fish is in the fish oil. Um, chondroitin from fish oil, $500 for an ounce. Yeah, can they make some money? So why would they lie to you hmm. and call this fish hydrolysate when they've actually taken the oils off? So gotta be careful. Um, there's a bunch of, of good um, places that make really good fish hydrolysate. We just started using a um, fish hydrolysate that they are adding chitin and chitosan, which are foods to grow the best fungi, the most beneficial. And yesterday we just finished an experiment with a class that was here. We put that um, fish hydrolysate with the chitin and chitosan into our compost. Um, we used another amendment like that. We used a third amendment, all of which are supposed to grow your fungi really, really well. Yeah, right. The um, fish hydrolysate with the chitin and the chitosan was the only thing that grew beneficial fungi. The other two products were like, killed things. Killed your bacteria, Whoa. killed the fungi, killed the protozoa. So the product is- So it's anaerobic. It didn't, it didn't dry thing, it didn't drive anything anaerobic. Huh. These, something in those other two products actually killed organisms. In the oh, so it didn't starve them, right, right, right. Didn't feed them, that's for sure. Killed them wow. instead.